Hello, how are you? Welcome back. If you did not watch my last video, I am taking a road trip to Colorado. You should go check out my prepping and packing video. Anyway, this is the start of the road trip. I'm like all of a sudden so excited. I don't understand, but obviously I do, I'm do. i excited for a reason. I'm going to go see Lou. Tonight I'm going to go see one of my best friends here in Texas. She lives in Midland. I am just so excited. It's Cinco de Mayo. I just got Diet Coke for the road. I got some double shot coffee. I am ready to go. I have all my stuff right here. Water's on deck. I am so ready. So follow along with me. I'm gonna drive and drive and drive. I'm getting there, I'm getting to Colorado tomorrow. Tonight I'm staying in Midland, so I'm really, really excited. Um, so let's take a road trip. I made it to my hotel. I am wearing, I got this shirt from Ross. We're gonna go to dinner and I'm gonna go meet her other, I met, she has two brothers, I'm gonna meet one of, I've already met one, I'm gonna meet the other one and her two doggies, my friend Raina. We're gonna go to dinner, I'm just gonna go hang out with her. I just thought it wanted to look, you know, cute. This is my vacation, technically. I mean, it's Wednesday and I'm gonna have to work until next Tuesday, so vacation. Even though I'm driving. <laughs> Anyway, I just freshened up into my makeup. I am dressed and I'm gonna head over there. I might change because I'm kind of self-conscious in this shirt. I can't decide. There's not a long mirror. Oh, there's a mirror right there. I just don't know. I just don't know. But anyway, I'm in Midland. I'm safe. Time to go see my friends. <laughs> <laughs> Those don't look like the New Orleans ones at all. With Raina. We're very weird. <laughs> we are the same type of weird though. That's what matters. Yeah. We're both idiots. We're both idiots. <laughs> okay. There she is. About to leave. Hello. Okay. Good morning. Bye -bye. It's 6 45. I'm on my way to Colorado now. It's what day is it? It's Thursday. I'm so excited. I'm so tired. I did not sleep well at the hotel last night, which is unfortunate. But I kept freaking myself out. I watched too much true crime and I kept and I was on the bottom floor and I kept thinking to myself, someone's gonna come in and kill me. So that's that's that. <laughs> I will not be listening to any true crime today. I am just ready to go see Lou, so let's go. We got nine and a half hours. I don't know what these are, but they're cool. I'm on the same road for like 150 miles. 87 North. We are out here. In Nowheresville. Mexico, woo! Made it! I'm out of Texas, woo! <laughs> I see snow-capped mountains in the distance. That's so cool. This is a very boring trip. I think I'm in Colorado, I'm not really sure. <laughs> Does this say something? No. Oh, clean Colorado. I'm in Colorado, ladies and gentlemen. Woo! Sky Colorado. Let's press against the bottles in the 
Yep, okay, I'm done. I mean, this is beautiful. This is absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Marina gave me a bag, a tire bag of snacks, candy. I already ate some candy on my way here. Gatorade, Yuhu, coffee, and Snapple. She really hooked me up. I didn't realize all this was in there when I was driving. Definitely be eating all of this though. Have arrived. <laughs> I got I got um, freshened up. I didn't look like this all day, obviously. I'm in Colorado. Blue had to go to work, and then I he's gonna come pick me up in like ten minutes. I have an appointment at Dry Bar. I'm so excited. Can you tell? I'm wearing this outfit today. Um, my hair is obviously not done because I'm, I'm gonna get it done at Dry Bar. They're gonna give me a blowout. I was supposed to go there with my friends and I couldn't because of the snow. So I booked an appointment here and I am uh, very excited about it. So, And then after I go there, I'm gonna shop around. There's a mall and then I'm gonna Uber back here and um, Lou has a cousin here in Colorado, like 10 minute, like 15 minutes away from the hotel. So we went and saw her last night. She has two, um, an 18 month old and a seven, an eight week old. Wow. So little babies. So we saw her last night and then we're going back to her house tonight and making her some Puerto Rican food. Um, she's half Puerto Rican, half Italian. She's his cousin on his mom's side. Unnecessary information, but she hasn't had Puerto Rican food in a while, so... Lou and I will be cooking for her and having a little party. <laughs> also going to get some margarita stuff. So it's going to be a good, good night and a good day. I'm so excited that I'm here in Colorado. Anyway, I will show you guys dry bar. I'm kind of shy filming in public. So if I can do it slyly, I will. But anyway, I'm excited. Here's, here's my hair before. Can you tell? Here's the before. I'm watching because I said so. Good movie. All right, so you had to change my appointment at Dry Bar. So I'm shopping, waiting for Lou to pick me up. I clearly need my hair washed. It's gonna be, I've gotten some good stuff. I got some clearance shoes from Target, a shirt from Marshalls, some new eyelashes from Target, you know, just doing all the things. What a beautiful day. About to get some lunch and then finally, go to my dry bar appointment. Such a colorado thing to do, shopping. <laughs> Yum. Thanks for the ride. You're welcome, have fun. <laughs> so excited. I'm here, ladies and gentlemen. dry bar. My hair is so freshy fresh. She said she's gonna give me an extra volume. I guess it's just my hair. <laughs> Hi. I'm back at the hotel, the one that um, Lou has. My hair is very pretty, very cute. I will say, if you know me, you know I have a hesitation. Um, she was, she told me she was going to give me a lot of volume, which I guess she tried. I have really, um, straight hair normally, so I guess this is the best volume that could have been done. Um, but that's fine. I just feel like it's a little, in certain pictures and certain angles, it looks really good. And then I feel like I look like a turtle, you know, but this is what it looks like coming home. That being said, I might play around with my part and definitely hairspray it a little bit. And I'd have to say overall, I probably won't ever go back to a dry bar again. Um, 
just because I can do this myself and I'm like, I know my hair and I know how to do it. i um, not trying to sound any type of way when I say that, but I guess it was, it was an experience. I was also just, I was kind of like irritated because um, they didn't offer me anything to drink, not even a water. I had to go ask for one after my appointment. So it was just kind of weird because I heard them offering other people. So I was just, I don't know if they just forgot about me or like forgot to ask me. I don't know. I don't understand. Okay. It was all for the experience. I went there. I can say I did it since I've been wanting to do it for a while. Was it worth $49? Mm, no, probably not. I tip, tip is on top of that, by the way. So like I said, let's be positive. The experience has been had. Check it off the list. Next time I get my hair done, I'm going to get it cut and colored. If I'm going to go, I'm going to get it all. You know what I mean? So that's that. But it is real. It does look good. I mean, I have beautiful hair. <laughs> but like I said, I'm just going to play around with the part and hairspray. I also need to touch up my makeup, obviously. So that's my dry bar Denver experience. Probably all dry bars because it's my same hair. It's probably difficult. I don't know. So since we're like talking about my hair. I'm putting it up in this scrunchie with like looseness to kind of get the volume going. And then while I touch up my face and then I'll um, take it down and respray it and stuff. I was gonna say something else. I forgot what I was gonna say, but I mean, guys. Oh, well, I know what I was gonna say. I said just now that if I get my hair done again, I'm going to get it cut and colored. And you guys know that I do that myself. My point was, I, I'm the type of person that does everything myself, including I put my own nails, press on nails on. Like, I don't go out very much except for to get pedicures and stuff. So if I was to spend money getting my hair done, I'm going to let them do the color and the cutting, even though I could do it myself. Like, I'm going to make it to make it easier on myself, you know? I think I'm gonna, I'm, next time I get my hair done, I'm going to get a haircut and have them style it. And if I don't like the style, that's fine. At least I got a haircut out of it. <laughs> this is just turning into a bash sesh. I'm not trying to bash dry bar. I'm just, I just wish that it was more for the hype that I had in my head. You know what I mean? I just wish, I just wish it was like, I turn, I, I wish I looked in that mirror and I was like, <laughs> you know, you know. Should have known. I have high hopes. I like set the bar really high. So my fault again. But anyway, I'm going to let this volume up a little bit and then touch my makeup up. Just my face. My eyes are looking very dark right now. So I don't want to touch those up. But I'm going to touch up my face makeup. And then we're going to Lou's cousin's house tonight for Puerto Rican food. Um, Lou marinated a pork shoulder that has been cooking in her oven since eight this morning, so that's gonna be really good. I'm gonna make rice with her, show her how I make it, and then we're also gonna make empanadas. Um, so yeah, we're gonna have a lot of food, and we'll also bring in stuff to make margaritas. It's gonna be the best. So anyway, I will show you guys the food once it's made. I'm, well, I'm not gonna vlog a lot over there just because I don't wanna make them uncomfortable. They have two kids and stuff, so I'll just probably show you guys the food and my drinks and maybe just the overview of the room. I don't want to overwhelm anybody, but anyway, I'm feeling very talkative. This place is really cool. Sorry. This is a dramatic effect video. Yeah. Breakfast burrito. Oh, and chicken and waffles. It smells so good.
Are you excited? I'm pretty excited. <laughs> I'm already out of breath. <laughs> I'm so winded. <laughs> this is so pretty. It really is. <laughs> Down. Oh, what's up? Oh. Live good from one. Colorado. <laughs> not my place but it's a tourist spot <laughs> wink no winky no winky <laughs> i'm not drinking this yet i need a drink <laughs> mm. Mm. young money
don't want to leave. <laughs> I'm just playing. But so Lou got me first class. Yeah, that's what I was going to say. She fancy, y'all. She fancy. Wearing a Britney Spears shirt. Yeah, I was going to say, she wearing a Britney Spears shirt. Britney Alba. She looks like Jessica Alba. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to leave. Baby, come back. Next week. Oh, look at Lou's shirt. It's Nintendo 64. Voice out. Target finds. I don't want to leave. Sorry, babe. I don't want you to leave either. I'll show you all first class when I get there. Say bye to Lou. See you later, guys. See you in a couple weeks. <laughs> <laughs> Big. I feel like I haven't seen you in forever. Oh. Did you miss me? Oh. Oh my God. Oh. Oh my goodness. daughter. Are you happy? <laughs> so it is obviously the next day. I am home. It's Monday. I took this day off as well. Kind of just doing laundry, cleaning up the cat stuff because I had cleaned the house before I left, which I always love doing. Last night I got into my bed and I remembered that I changed the sheets the morning before I left and I was like, love me for that. But anyway, 
I want to show you guys my hair. I did it myself this morning. It's fresh. And look at all this volume that I have. And this is just from, like, I curled my hair. I don't, so obviously my hair can be volumized. It just was not after dry bar. I was expecting this times 10 when she said extra volume. I was expecting, like, woo, so I would, like, leave there, not leave there like this, you know? You know what I'm saying? Anyway. I'm gonna close out this vlog, and I also wanted to say I did not end up taking any videos or pictures with Lou, Lou's cousins that live in Colorado, which is very unfortunate. She's a new mom, so she didn't get ready, so she didn't want to take any pictures, and I was cooking, and I needed my phone for recipes, so I didn't even get a chance to record any videos, so that was unfortunate, but we had a really good time with her. So I'm glad we were like in the moment with her for that. Um, I know I was in Colorado and you guys had seen that I went to a dispensary. I did not partake in anything. It's not something that I do. I'm not against it. I'm just not into it. So I went to say that I went, but I didn't experience anything crazy with that. Um, I think that's it. I am about to enjoy the day with Bo. I missed her so much, so maybe I'll take her for a car ride or something later. I'm not sure. She's just staring at me over there. Anyway, <laughs> I'm going. I already got some lunch. I'm just going to chill out, and then I have an appointment later. So, yeah, what a great day. I had so much fun. I miss Lou so much already, though. <clears throat> I'm... I won't see him again until Memorial Day weekend, so I have a few more weeks of being alone. It's kind of getting old. I just got back and I'm already like, ugh, I gotta be alone longer. But it's okay. I hope you guys, and <clears throat> sorry, I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Oh, first class, so worth it. Like, as you guys saw, I had so much leg room. I had free drink in there. I was the first one off the plane. Like, everything was perfect. Um, I got back to the airport and I was going to Uber back home and it was $89. And I was like, I'm not going to spend $89. So my, luckily my friend had texted me and said, do you let us know if you need a ride? And I was like, do you mind? <laughs> do you mind driving 25 minutes out of the way? She, they're my neighbors at the same ones that watch the cats. So that was really nice of them. I will be treating them to dinner soon. All that to say... I had a great time. I'm back home, quiet by myself, but I'm in the company of my animals. So that's all that matters. So thank you guys so much for watching. I will post every Thursday and Saturday, usually. Um, my name is Casey again, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much.